Hello everybody, Fiber Spider here uh, with some mm, news. We'll, we'll see about this, I don't know, but at any rate, uh, the other day I did the announcement of the, the, the new winner of my giveaway, and that person, you know, had got in contact with me, and I'm going to be shipping out the blanket uh, as soon as I can, and, you know, all systems go, no problem. You know, congratulations to Barbara. Um, and I'm just, I'm happy that she got in contact with me and everything on that end is copacetic. Now, this morning I woke up to a message from a viewer saying, oh, thank you so much for, you know, picking me for the giveaway. And I'm like, huh? And she sent me a, a screen capture of the, the reply to her comment saying, and I quote, I wrote it down. Um, now here, all right. Sorry, I'm the the little the little circle image of the the user was my icon. It was my image. However, it was not my name. Um, you know, it wasn't my username. So I'm thinking that I'm I don't know, but I'm thinking and hoping that my account wasn't hacked. Um, and so it wasn't my name. It was a phone number, which I don't know that phone number. That's not my phone number. Um, and it was, you know, text, you know, and then like a, a phone number with an area code. I don't even know, but it had my image, uh, of my little amigurumi face. And it says, congrats. You have been selected among our shortlisted winners from our previous giveaway contact the number above. That is not me. I would not write that. There's only one winner uh, to my giveaways. I did, I did a giveaway once where there were three winners, if I remember this correctly. Um, but no, that, that isn't me. And also, I think I would say congratulations, not congrats. You know, saying congrats is a little too succinct for something cool. Um, so, that being said, uh, I don't wish to alarm any of you, but I do want you to be aware that if you had seen that reply to one of your comments, that no, that was not in fact me. Okay. Um, and I did hit spam on one of those comments, and I also hit, you know, hide user from channel, so hopefully that won't be a problem in the future. I don't know. But just to be on the safe side so that this didn't get out any further than I could help. What I did was I decided to disable the comments on that video so that hopefully that won't be more of a thing. Now, the reason why that I'm doing this video right now is to explain everything that I know on my end, um, also so that there isn't a further perpetuation of, you know, and uh, wonder and questionability and so on and so forth. Honestly, I don't know, but I've always been transparent with you guys and I continue to, I, I plan on continuing to be as transparent as possible with you guys because I care and I I don't run scamage, okay? No, Let, let's, no. Honestly, I don't know what exactly happened. There are tons and tons of scams out there on the internet uh, via, you know, robocalls and that sort of thing. The only thing I can think of is that they're like, hmm, maybe we can cash in on this. And so they did like a screen capture of my little icon and then did a cut and paste and decided to try to finagle people that way, but that wasn't me. Um, so I'm sorry if there was any confusion with any of you, but I'm, I'm doing what I can. If any of you have any suggestions of further action that I could take, please let me know. Um, but yeah, I, I, I hid the comments, so hopefully this will become a moot point. But of course, I did want to address the issue as soon as it was brought to my attention. So 
That being said, I want to thank all of you, you know, faithful supporters of the channel. You mean ever so much to me, and I would never do anything to harm you in any way, shape, or form. And I, I'm pretty sure you guys know that. <laughs> so that that being said, if ever you see me writing a comment saying text this number, that is not me. The last thing I would ever do is give my personal phone number, uh, you know, on a comment. You know, the only thing I have ever given was, you know, my P.O. box. And, well, that's a public post office box. So at any rate, what a way to wake up, right? Mm. Yeah. It's like before I even had my coffee, uh, listen, I hope all of you are doing well, continue to be doing well, staying inspired, staying caffeinated, which I'm not even there yet. I haven't even had half a cup of coffee yet. Um, but, uh, and please stay safe even cyber safe out there. And uh, I hope you have a great weekend and I will see you in my next video. Have a good day, everybody, and take care.